I'll time up for you whenever you're ready to go ahead. Have you ever been bored? If you're a human, I'm sure you have. Well, I have I got the thing for you. This activity is going to teach you a fairly easy, once you get used to it, uh, project to do, and it's quite fun. Uh, not to mention that once you make it, it's pretty to look at. I will teach you how to carefully craft the God's Eye, which in Spanish is Ojo de Dios. And I will give you a few facts about it, show you the creating process, and then show you how you can start building your own. And now I'm going to begin. First you're going to start by cutting a fabric color of your choosing. There's many different yarn colors you can get. You're going to grab your sticks and you're going to want to glue them together beforehand so that they're not shifting around while you're trying to wrap it. For the base, you're going to want to tie a slip knot around it. So you're going to go figure eight around the sticks until you're satisfied. And then once you're ready to wrap the outside, you're going to go through the X and then around through the X. And then around. And when you're doing it, you want to make sure that you line them up carefully or it's not going to look very good. And also, when you're doing it, make sure you're wrapping from the back of the sticks. Because if you don't, it's going to come out looking weird. Some facts about this craft. Uh, they were made to be put on altars for, by Native Americans for protection from their gods. Um, they would you know, bring you good luck. And when you're ready for a new color, you're going to take that one. This can be kind of tricky if you have bigger hands <laughs> working on a small area. There we go. And then do the same thing. So through the X and then around. It took me a while to get this down. <laughs> Surprisingly. It actually took me and my mother about an hour to figure this out. We were kind of insulted because when I looked it up it said, this is an easy project for like second graders to do. And it was confusing us. <laughs> so. Um, and then once you're done, it's going to come out looking like this. Um, I'll show you the first one that, <laughs> that I made. It's super fat. <laughs> looks pretty bad. Maybe I chose the wrong colors on that one. Okay. Um, this was discovered by the early Spaniards. Uh, when they came to America, they found a group of Indians called uh, the Wichita Indians, and uh, they used it for protection over their communities and mostly children, young children. Um, it could also be found in South America, where other Indian groups were. Um, when traditionally made, it is expressing a prayer to that the eye of God would watch over the people. Uh, 
And a quote from it was, may the eye of God be upon you, commonly said. Um, for you to start, all you need is two popsicle sticks, or you can use chopsticks or bamboo skews. And once you get really advanced, you can move on to using actual sticks, which is what the Native Americans use. Once you're finished, you can attach tassels, ribbons, uh, feathers, and even photos if you want to. Uh, I hope you learned something today, and I hope you are able to craft these on your own. Have fun. Thank you very much. Give a